salutations everyone uh i know this is a little weird right this isn't an edited video this is more unscripted uh i want to talk about my thoughts and opinions on uh super mario wonder which will be releasing actually at the end of this week <laughs> when this releases uh, october 20th i was uh fortunate enough to uh be near the vicinity of a best buy that had the demo <laughs> Uh, I believe it's the one from like PAX West or something like that. I'm not entirely sure, but uh, luckily here in Canada, we unfortunately don't have it available at Walmarts or GameStops or uh, Targets, but specifically at Best Buy and the Best Buy near me only has a functional Nintendo Switch Lite. <laughs> so I couldn't play on TV. I couldn't play on regular Switch or an OLED. Instead, I was forced to play on a regular Switch Lite, which um, good thing I had hand sanitizer on standby. Unfortunately, can't clean the screen. That's not allowed, I don't think. I don't, uh, I don't think I can do anything to help myself in this situation. Other than try my best to stay <laughs> fine for the next 10 minutes. But, yeah, here, playing Super Mario Wonder. And I gotta say, this is one of the greatest Mario games I can tell already. Especially for 2D Mario, obviously. Um, but it is something beyond belief i don't know how they've done it but i can only imagine that if i played super mario world back in uh the 1990s when it released on the snes that appreciation that somebody has for playing it back then i would say 100 percent this must be the magic that they felt when they played a 2d mario game first you have super uh mario brothers obviously uh for the nes uh and then you know two and three uh built upon the formula and made something oh so grand but then you had world which incorporates so many new elements so many new power-ups more characters and everything i think that when you take a look and look at uh new super mario brothers on the ds on the 3ds on the wii the wii u you look at those and they did fantastic things for the uh for the series for the 2d series especially in uh some new power-ups um fun stories great levels things like that more for i'd say ds uh we and uh 3ds uh wii u didn't exactly need to exist but it was you know more mario wonder brings so much to the table as you can see already on uh on the screen i am playing through one of the wonder flower stages uh these segments where you basically want to get a wonder seed there's many that you collect throughout the games by the looks of it the demo specifically <laughs> i don't know how many you can collect probably up to 10 but there's like a cap like at 99 so it's impossible to get in you only get like 10 minutes to play the demo unfortunately uh, but 10 minutes is way enough to tell if you're gonna love this game and i gotta say the feeling of the game is just immaculate perfect i it, it like it is reminiscent of new super mario brothers i'll i'll say that for sure that's something i noticed that okay if you've played the previous entries obviously there's nothing nothing huge that's new to the table like that's uh movement wise that you're gonna feel like oh my goodness this is like completely different like i guess from odyssey to uh galaxy or like odyssey from sunshine stuff like that right the 3d mario games for 2d mario yeah it doesn't feel that drastically different but what is completely mixed up is by the badges the badge system uh and the new power-ups obviously bring a new dynamic to the game that i think is oh so wonderful uh the badges are a lot of fun being able to like uh specifically in demo you only get five uh to start off with i believe you only get uh the float uh i don't remember what the other one is then you get like to start at the level with mushroom things like this uh i would say probably everyone's gonna go <laughs> off the bat with the float uh cap just because it feels uh i guess it kind of feels like the acorn from uh new super mario brothers u in that sense it's not as good as the propeller but you know you get to float for a bit uh but uh there was one that you get later in the demo that's pretty fun uh, if you complete one of the special stages which i will do uh that allows you to wall kick or wall jump is what they call it wall jump and you basically just get a mid or jump if you slide on the wall it's pretty intuitive and it's pretty fun being able to chain uh certain jumps uh off walls onto like a, just a regular wall kick into a into a spin like mid or spin uh <laughs> i haven't even touched upon the fact that i played as luigi in the demo i gotta say the new voice actor was recently um announced i believe it's kevin 
uh, Afghani, and they don't haven't done much by looks of it in terms of voice acting. Uh, what I would know them from, I guess, is Genshin Impact, but they did a really good job with Luigi and Mario from the little bits of the demo that I played uh, from recorded. You see, I played Luigi. Uh, I did go to Best Buy with uh, someone else, and they played as Mario, and yeah, again, I got to hear them, and I think they did fantastic. I don't know if Charles Martinez is in the booth with them, uh, coaching them, <laughs> uh, but they they did fantastic, and I'm excited to see where they go with, uh, with the new voice, uh, how they get to uh, work in future Mario games, and you know, uh, develop more and more to create that, uh, to bring the same magic that Charles Martinet did. Or as well, you know, making something new. Uh, I'm excited for that. They did fantastic. The other voices, the other characters sound pretty similar as well to, again, what they sound in other Mario titles. And yeah, unfortunately, I didn't really get to play them uh, because, again, it's a 10-minute demo. We're kind of in public. We, we <laughs> There's other people that kind of, like, you know, are looking around these booths, perhaps also wanted to play the demo for all I know. There was some, uh, there was a kid who wanted to play uh, the, the Switch Lite as well, I assume, because their parents were shopping and they played the Odyssey demo, <laughs> which is interesting. Uh, Wonders right there. But yeah, the game is fantastic. The levels are really good compared to previous Mario titles. Uh, you get two Wonder Seeds to collect per level. It looks like it differentiates as well. One through the Wonder section. Uh, and then the other one by just touching the flagpole at the top by looks of it. And then there are ten uh, big purple coins that you have to uh, collect um, in the levels. That I don't know if they count towards completion. But I assume that whether it's official or not fans are gonna probably just go for them regardless because i guess it feels like if there's a an indicator on the level you're probably gonna feel like gotta go for them you know that's like what super mario 3 uh, world brought to the table but yeah this is the desert section uh the ones you just saw were uh just the regular uh two stages that you get for the demo you get uh three i guess <laughs> challenge stages i guess bite-sized stages where it more focuses on a certain ability or certain power for certain badge i guess uh one i guess more focuses on uh one of the new enemies the bull rushes i believe as well as the drill um mushroom i think it is <laughs> the drill hat i suppose uh the other one is for the wall jump badge that i was mentioning the other one i'm not entirely too sure i didn't fully play it i think or i might play it right now i just bought the coin magnet and the standee that's just gotcha i'm excited to just do gotcha <laughs> i don't know if there's a finite amount of purple coins to collect i hope we can just redo levels and optimize which is the best ones to collect for uh purple coins but i'm excited to just get a bunch of standees it's not even the point of using them i believe they work as mini check uh checkpoints uh that you can use around the stage but uh i just want to collect them all <laughs> because that's just me i fear that i'm gonna try to 100 percent this game i know that i'm not gonna be streaming it i'm gonna play it more with my little brother off stream so that's why i'm kind of doing this bite-sized little thing but yeah the game is wonderful it's so it like again it, there, it, it makes sense why it's called super mario brothers wonder it's just wonderful the music is comparable to the other new super mario brothers game but there is something distinct to it that just is great on the ears especially as well with the sound department the jumps that sound like a string instrument the new uh again the new voicing the world is so vibrant and pleasant to watch as you can see in the background the flower kingdom is going to be just fun to explore because it's going to be something new like you know different than uh than the mushroom kingdom right we're used to those backdrops but this is going to be something interesting to look at and they're they're working so well with it and then again the art style i don't even need to tell you just looks so new fresh amazing compared to the previous uh news of my brother's entries again not to say not to discredit uh what they did for the ds and for the other systems and for nintendo fans in general especially 2d mario fans but super mario brothers wonder this is gonna be so good i'm excited for the next couple days where um it finally releases and everyone's gonna be playing i can't wait to play online you can't play online during the demo and again you're very you're very restricted during the demo using just a few badges and only being able to do a couple stages it's it's not much but it's for 10 minutes it is 100% worth it to get your hands on to try out uh, how the game feels, how it plays, and, you know, just fall in love with it in general. I wish I could play two players with my brother, but unfortunately I couldn't. But yeah, that's basically my thoughts on the demo. It was a lot of fun. It was bite-sized, but for sure, 100% worth it. And I know this is going to be... Honestly, this might 
No, well, Futures Connected, <laughs> Xenoblade Chronicles is gonna is it has to be my uh, game of the year. But this is gonna be for sure a extremely close second. I know the other one's DLC. I guess if it's we're talking about full games, I think Super Mario Brothers Wonder is gonna fill that void. Other than Tears of the Kingdom, those those have been fantastic games. The Switch is going strong as hell, ending in uh, 2023. But yeah, I highly suggest that you guys go to your local uh game store that may have this uh demo if you have it available i don't know why nintendo just didn't release this in uh in store like i mean online because oh my goodness it's so good it's so refreshing it's so addictive i just played like me and my mother we uh played the demo like two times each and we wanted to play way more but we couldn't but yeah i'm excited for friday i'm gonna pick it up on launch day i apologize that i can't stream it but for sure you guys should 100 percent get super Mario brothers wonder or at least play the demo in stores it's funny because there was a GameStop uh nearby outside uh the like uh i think like five minutes away they did not have the demo <laughs> they had a stand they had like uh one of those posters that you can see for super Mario brothers wonder so i was like Haha. <laughs> it's a little funny but yeah i'm excited the game feels amazing i have to try all the new characters i gotta 100 this game it's beautiful it's immaculate the art style is wonderful as i've just said <laughs> the, it's just, everything's so good i'm so excited uh but yeah i don't know if that was uh helpful for you guys to decide if you want to get super mario brothers wonder i know super mario uh sorry sonic superstars is coming out soon i think in the next couple days so again we uh, 2d platformer fans are for sure eden and i'm excited uh regardless uh so yeah that's all i had to really plan out for today this is something small i'm working on a video hopefully we do more streams but i'm figuring my own stuff out but i just wanted to provide this little footage just in case uh you don't have uh the ability to or i guess there's no access to playing the demo till the game releases but again only a couple days left uh but yeah sorry that this was pretty much unscripted unedited and just me rambling i hope you enjoyed this should i do more of this in the future i don't know you guys tell me I, what would i even do <laughs> i don't know what i do but yeah thank you everyone uh hydrate love you guys all right enjoy super Mario brothers wonder when it releases bye guys